Hello students, I am Marco Severo and this is the Marketing Analytics course. This is the first lecture of the practical activities. In this lecture, I'm going to show you how to open Gretel software and then open a data, data set, an Excel file using uh, Gretel software. Okay, so this is the Gretel. Uh, it is a free German statistical software. And Gretel it stands for GNU Regression Econometric and Time Series Library. I'm going to put available the link uh, to download Gretel in the description of this video. So imagine that you want to open the data set and uh, the following data set that we are going to use is inside this folder, Marketing Analytics. And the name of the file is Hollywood Movies. Okay, so it's a data set. Uh, of movies from Hollywood and their receipts, uh, the the revenue generated and, and, and the stars given by by people that watch the movies and etc. We're going to use in this course. So the first thing we need to do, you have to click on file. File, open data, and then user file. And then now I'm going to find where my data set is located. So it's in marketing analytics, see, right here. And now, just let me erase this here just a second. Uh, so now we have a problem. We are not finding the data set right here. It's because we have to change, we have to change the option for uh, for files uh, we have to find for uh, Excel files okay so here they are Hollywood movies and then I open and the first thing it, it's going to ask me is which column and which row I want uh, to open the spreadsheet to start the import of the spreadsheet just column, in this case, it's column one, row one. I'm going to click on OK. Uh, so I'm going to show this later, but an important thing is that in this case, we have cross-section data, and uh, Gretel asks you if you are using uh, time series panel data or cross-sectional data. In our case, it is a cross-section, so they ask you if we want to give the data time series uh, or panel interpretation. In this case, it's no. Uh, a second thing is that we have a string variable in our data set, and the string variable refer, uh, we have some string variable, sorry. So the, the lead studio variable is a string variable, and Gretel automatically categorizes the values to numbers, so uh, it's showing me that number one was attributed to Sony, number two was attributed to Paramount Studio, and, and this go forth until the last studio. You see the 59. The same thing happened uh, happened with the story uh, variable, which was a string one, so it generates numbers ordered numbers and the same thing happened to the genre of the movies okay i'm going to close here so this is the data set and what is the main uh, the main interface for gretel so this is the number of the variables these are the co the rows uh, these are the columns for the Excel spreadsheet, and this is coming in a list format. So we have the following variables, Lead Studio, Rotten Tomatoes, probably a score for open Rotten Tomatoes, Audience Score, Story, January, uh, if it's an open week for theaters, let me see if this is a dummy variable. No, it's not a dummy variable, so this is, this is a quantitative variable. Open weekend. Uh, average open weekend domestic gross revenue, foreign gross revenue from movies, world gross revenue, budget, uh, probably the budget from the studio they had to advertise the to advertise the movie, profitability, open profit, and year. 
So this is the data set we're going to work in the next practical lessons. And well, this is how to open uh, a, a, an Excel file into Gretel. Now we're going to save it. Uh, so I'm going to, I go to File, Save Data S, uh, and I'm going to save as Gretel. Sorry, okay. Uh, it's Save Data. Uh, sorry, just Save Data. Uh, in this case, Hollywood Movies Point GDT, which is the Gretel basic format. I'm, I'm saving in the same folder that I opened the, the Excel file. So I click on Save. Well, my data set is saved and ready to run. Thank you very much.